everybody so today I'm gonna to be doing a tutorial or yeah I guess a tutorial on my everyday routine like my entire makeup routine so yeah let's get started so the on I'm makeup list right now yes this is my face film makeup um so yeah let's fix this up so I'm gonna take my Maybelline mineral power concealer and this is in sand and I just Dab this under my eye, and then right there. Sorry, I'm using the camera because this is a Mac, and this is my first time filming with a Mac. And it's, you know, different sides and stuff, so it's just weird. Okay, so then I put some on my nose. Remove my mute. And then on my forehead and on top of my eyebrows. And then I take my Eco Tools foundation brush and just blend in all of... Yeah, I can see that. Okay, so when I'm done blending it all in, this is what it looks like. And sometimes that brush leaves streaks, so I take my ring fingers and I just lightly just rub it on the spot to where I put in concealer, just so I'm not a streaky person. I have oily skin. I don't use like liquid foundation instead. Or actually, I don't use foundation at all, but I use powder, and this is the Revlon Photo Ready powder in light medium. It's kind of messy in there from all the powder, but you, you know, I've hit pan. So I'm going to take my Jane Iredell blending brush and just swirl it in there. And then just brush it into my face. I usually go cheek. Cheek. Yeah. And then mouth. And then forehead. And then... Nose. And then around my eyes, I take a smaller brush and I use my e.l.f. brush and I just take some more and go around my eyes. Then, <clears throat> to make my face look a little bit more glowy, bronzy, I guess, I take my Hard Candy Bronzer in Hula Hula and I take my e.l.f. Kabuki brush. Where is e.l.f.? Okay, whatever. And I tap off the excess of my hand. Well, first I tap it in two times. And then I tap off the excess of my hand and then just. Buff it in my cheekbones a little bit, I guess. Like, I don't do, like, full, like, on, full-on contouring. I just kind of put it there, and I take a little bit more. And put it in my temples, and I bet you I'm getting some of this in my hair. And then when I'm done, I go do the 3B method, and then down my nose, and my ass. And, of course, I do my neck. And that's it for the foundation part of my retain. Now, for the eyes, I use my, let's say my Color Mix. Now, this is like a homemade primer I made. Um, it just consists of concealer and um, some body butter. And I just dip my finger in there. And I just put some on my eye. Where are you? There you are. And then I just use my ring finger and blend it. Okay. And then... I take some more of this powder, and with the little brush, there's already a little bit of fallen powder on it. And I just dot over my eyes really fast, just to soak up a little bit of the primer and make my eyeshadows blend easier, because my eyelids get really oily, so I like to have big crease marks in my crease. And, you know, it's just beautiful, but, you know, I don't like them. It's just not Now, me. taking my bronzer again, I'm going to be taking my Sheer Cover Studio um, fluffy brush, and I just dip it in the bronzer, tap off the excess, and then... I just basically sweep it all over my eye and up in the crease. So then I take my, and my powder exploded, and it went all over my stuff, so excuse the messiness. I take my Lancome quad, and I take, oh, my bad, sorry. I take this color right here, and it's called Impress. And I just do the same thing, I tap it in there, tap off the excess, and then I just run it all over again. This is just so it gives it more of a brown feeling too, instead of just, you know, bronze. And then, taking the same eyeshadows, I'm going to take that one right here, and it's called Avant Gold. And I just take my pinky, tap off the excess, and then I just dab, 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 dab in the inner corner. And that's just my highlight in the inner corner. 
I like doing it this way because it kind of blends it out when you're dabbing and it doesn't give you like a whole bunch load of color. Then taking my Eco Tools brush roll and taking the littlest guy here, just a little pencil guy. I'm going to be taking the bronzer again and just pencil them up. Tap off the excess and then run it right under your eye. Just so like, sorry, hang on. Just so like whenever you put on like eyeliner under there, because mine likes to run off and make me look like I have raccoon eyes. So in order to prevent this, I put this mm. next as eyeliner. And I am using, I use two different ones, one for the top and one for the bottom. So for the top, I use my Annabelle Cole eyeliner in black. And then for my waterline, I use my Stila Kajal eyeliner in onyx. Because I know this breaks way too easily, like when you do it up here and it just... For me, it's not too intense black like this is, so. Okay, so I'm going to try and do this on camera. I'm sorry if I show my face in the camera. It's just, I don't know. I, can't, I was trying to put my mirror up here, but I couldn't figure out how, but that's okay. Oh, I got powder in my eye. Okay, so all I do is I just basically line from the inner corner to the outer corner, and then I flick it out. So, line it up. Bring it up like that, and then bring it down like that, and there's the wing. And then you just do the easy part and throw it in like that. You see? That was so easy. Now I'm going to do this eye. Now, taking my Body Shop just kind of eyeshadow brush um, and my Sephora Black Eyeshadow in Must Have. I'm just going to pick some up with a tippy dough. And then. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Okay. And then I'm just going to. Go over top of the eyeliner just to set it because, like I said, my eyes crease really easily. So I'm setting my eyeliner just so it doesn't crease all over my eye. So I just. Sorry about the background noise, right? Because there's a heater kicking in sometimes and it's a lot. And then my little brother and my future stepbrother are gonna are just playing in the background with this um, toy truck, so it's like Rawr! So yeah. I'm just gonna curl my eyelashes. I just look like this. Yes, I become a hunchback when I do my mascara. Just like this. So next, I do my Stila Kajal eyeliner. You're probably like, why didn't you do this when you did your top? Well. I usually do this just about when I'm leave, so it's like fresh for when I get to school. Because if I do, if I put it on before, like 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 you know, then then it's not as fresh and stuff, and it's kind of. So if I do it just before I leave, then it's all fresh and still beautiful looking. Okay, so I just take it, and I'm not not yanking down on my eye. I'm just put my pinky down, and then I just pull it a little. So now, it, whoa, my eyes look, whoa. <laughs> they look so dark and, like, I believe me, in real life, this does not look this way. Like, it doesn't look so dark and intense. See, when I go like this, you can't even see my eyes. Wow, they're black. Anyway, so now for lips, I just take my concealer, as you guys know, put two little dots, and leave it like this. All right, thank you for watching, and I'll be posting more videos soon. I'm uh, just joking. Now I'm landing in with my ring finger. I guess it doesn't have to be my ring finger, but you know. Oh, now I'm using my middle finger. Ooh. Just like that. So then to make, make me look, my lips not so, not there, I use my Ardeen lip gloss, and this is in Twinkle Twinkle. So I just put some on my finger. And just... So this concludes the makeup tutorial. So here's me. This is what I do every single day. Unless I'm sick or something. If I'm sick, I don't do anything. But here's me all makeup up. And I know already that people are going to be like, Girl, you don't need that much makeup. Or girl, you're such a cake face. Or girl, you way too young. And sweetie, you're too young to be, be playing with that. Go play on the park. And yes, I do get comments like that, and I just laugh at them. But, I don't know, I don't think it's that much. Like, compared to 
some people I see in the mall, like, not trying to put anybody down, but I mean, I see some girls my age at the mall, like, with eyeliner rimmed around their eyes, and just cake face makeup and all that, and, like, I really don't think I wear that much. Like, it's not like I wear foundation and powder foundation, and it's not like I rim my eyeliner around my face a hundred times. And, you know, it's not like I'm one of those kids that go do drugs in the street or I'm drinking and partying. No, I just wear makeup. That's the only thing about me. But it's like, I don't know. I don't know why people are all like, oh my gosh, you're wearing so much makeup. It's like, I'm not, it's not like I'm doing anything bad. It's not like I'm murdering people. I'm just wearing makeup. That's just who I is. All right. Sorry about my little rant there. Um, just had to get it off my chest, you know? Okay, so I will probably do another video later um, on nose piercing because I, I said that I was going to do that video. No, I haven't forgotten. I will do it. Um, so, yeah. Thank you for watching. I'll be posting more videos soon. Peace out, home dog.